Planned Parenthood has now grown to nearly 900 clinics throughout the United States and operates an astounding $1 billion annual budget and affects the lives of millions of people. Planned Parenthood is well known for its claim to help women and families with reproductive health and child health services. Founded by Margaret Sanger and originally called the American Birth Control League in 1921, Planned Parenthood has now grown to nearly 900 clinics throughout the United States and operates an astounding $1 billion annual budget and affects the lives of millions of people. What you are about to witness in this jaw-dropping expose as we examine the roots and fruit of Planned Parenthood is that when one gets beyond Planned Parenthood's deceptive public guise and takes a look at its dark underbelly, one finds that Planned Parenthood is contributing greatly to the moral decline of the United States of America and the murder of millions of innocent children. It should disturb most blacks that she specifically was a racist, a eugenicist, a socialist, and uh, was determined to clear the planet of what she called the unfit. The elimination of human weeds for the cessation of charity because it prolonged the lives of the unfit, for segregation of morons, misfits, and the maladjusted, and for the sterilization of genetically inferior races. Since then, nearly 15 million black children have been murdered as a result of Margaret Sanger's Planned Parenthood and other pro-abortious campaigns that have made millions of dollars in the process. In Planned Parenthood's 1985 annual report, leaders of the organization proclaimed that they were, quote, proud of our past and planning for our future. Notice that Planned Parenthood cast their superhero as a black woman, which would have pleased Margaret Sanger, who, as we've seen, sought to appeal to African Americans in an effort to deceive them. I think the greatest sin in the world is bringing children into the world that have disease from their parents, that have no chance in the world to be a human being, practically, delinquents, prisoners, all sorts of things just mock when they're born. Here we see from a new Planned Parenthood sponsored website, a young guy and gal talking about getting together and having group sex, which is portrayed as acceptable by Planned Parenthood so long as they use protection. Tragically, Planned Parenthood's so-called sex education website, TeenWire, has provided their young users a direct link to a site run by pedophiles.